Hi, this is Linda Caffey, Team Run Smart Pro. Bob is going to show me how to check the power steering, power steering fluid on our 2015 Cascadia. So let's get started while Bob walks me through this. First thing we got to do is open the hood. We've already unlatched the hood on the other side. Quite simple. Unlatch and pull. There we go. So first thing, first thing we do is got to find the power steering reservoir, and it's kind of marked right here. Power steering fluid, do oh, not simple. overfill. So this was pretty simple. Also, it has a sight glass or sight gauge, and we are sitting on a little bit of a lean, but you can look in here and see the the fluid is right up here, and right here it says max fill and minimum cold. So those two. If it's anywhere in here, you're good. But like I said, we're, we're leaning pretty hard to this side is why it's showing it's a little bit over full. But other than that, the power stream filter is inside here. It's kind of a job to change. So is that something I would probably take into a shop and or else just have you show me do it? Could I actually do it if you showed me how? Oh, uh, no, you, you actually have to take the coolant or the reservoir off and there's three bolts. and. It's a, it's a little bit of a job. I did a, a video on it earlier um, in the year. You feel right here? And that's where you feel if it's low. So if you do need to add fluid, there's the cap right there. And you, before you take any cap off, you always wipe, wipe it off to make sure there's no dirt that could fall in into the reservoir and contaminate your, your fluids. Then the, the cap just lifts off. And as you can see, there's a little bit of dust in there. You can see the, the cap has an O-ring right here, and that's to keep the dust out. It's, it's vented just a little bit. So before we put it back on, we'll very carefully wipe the dirt from inside that hole. And right here? And, and right there on the, all the way up into the bottom side of the cap. I suppose if you had some brake clean, you could rinse the cap off as well. Just make sure when you're wiping, you don't get any of the, the dirt or anything inside the reservoir. So that's where you would add fluid if you needed to. Make sure the cap's back on tight, and there we go. All right, it's time to shut the hood. And get on down the road. Shut the hood on this truck. Oh. Alright, this is Bob and Linda Caffey, Team Run Smart Pros, showing you how to check power the power steering. <laughs> Thanks for watching.